Hello and welcome. I am Abby Yonsei Beats and I produce Afro Beats Instrumental on this page. But today I'm not going to take you through Afro Beats Instrumental, but ra rather, rather I'm going to be taking you through how I mix this song. I want to show you how I mix this song. So I'm about to play the song to you. I'll play a few bars of the song. Then I will remove all the effects I put on it and show you how I, I brought it, those effects in one at a time. So let me play you a few bars of this banger. Shout out to my boy, daddy, and rapper Nasty. Oh, Don't call me mossy, oh, I'm on the rise, I don't want to die, somebody save me They want my blessing, they know what destiny Please don't push me, judge your feet to protect me Nobody feet to stop me Why you want to stop my shine, stop my shine I, I, Test me, test me So this is a song, Fight to Destiny For my boy daddy and rapper nasty now this is the vocal box all these all those vocals are routed to their individual tracks and then they are sent to this vocal box so i will remove every infant i have here and then i'll bring them in one at a time so that you guys can hear how i mix Big song. So first of all, I added an auto tune. So with the auto tune, the vocal sound on key, the key of the song is C. I make the auto tune fast. I tune this step of input, which is auto tuner. The vocal will sound key, but then it will still be fit on the on the beat. You see, you have to hear the vocal because it is in a raw state. Nothing is there yet apart from this auto tune. So, it needs life at this point. The vocal needs life. Firstly, before you start mixing, you have to listen. And then now you will now guess what is lacking in the vocal. So, you now subtract before you are out. So, since the vocal needs life, we remove the background noise. So, this plugin here is called NS1 Stereo. It's there to remove any room noise, any grounding uh, that is within the background of the vocal. And then, after that plugin, I realized that the vocal needed some clarity. There are some frequencies that was far off, especially the low end. So I cut off the low end up to 145 hertz. And then I cut off some of the high end up to 13 kilohertz. And then I uh, cut some res resonating frequencies that was bad within the vocal. And then I did some compression. This compression is CL compression, compressor on waves. It, it is a little opposite to all a regular compression. All a regular compressor. It, it is a little opposite because on the normal compressors that we have around here, now, for example, the the stock plug-in compressor from this FL Studio, when the, the the higher you go on the attack and the release, the slower it becomes. But for here, 
the higher you go, the faster you become. So I went, I took a very fast attack and a very fast release because I only wanted the compressor to be cutting off the hard transient within the focal or not to be squashing them. So I didn't do too much compression. Instead, I just tip it in a way that it will just cut off because when an artist is singing, no single is constant in volume. And you know, every single will go at a very high pitch and then it will come down low. So the compressor saw is here to help to, to reduce what those hard notes that is focalists will hit, those hard transient. So I, I, I never wanted that transient to, to be squashed because if, if it is squashed, it will, it will, it will, it will disturb, it, it will erase the dynamics within the song. That's why I use a fast release and a fast attack so that it will just hit it and leave it instead of sticking on it. If you want me to do a video concerning compressor, then you can comment on this video. I will do a separate video where I will be teaching compressor. So that's what I did here. And then I listing Kine to be able to adjust the input and the output. So now, after that, the focus sound like this. So at this junction, intersection, and saga, you can now realize that the vocal is coming alive, but still need more life. So at that point, I added this plugin. It's a stock plugin from this Apple Studio. It's called Sound Goodazo. Now, this plugin can be used as a distortion plugin or a saturation. So if you if you do too much of it, it will like want to spoil the vocal. So you have to adjust it in a way that it will, it will suit. So I took this letter D, but letter D doesn't change the tune. Some of these letters here will change the tune of the original vocal, but this letter D will stay there. So I choose it and then I just adjust it here because I wanted the vocal to have strength. So after I place that, it sounded like this. So now you can hear that the vocal is coming alive. At this point, I added another compressor. This compressor is from Fafrito. I just randomly choose this preset because I was looking for something that would boost the vocal to make it to glue together and have more strength. Because this beat has a lot of instrumentation going on within it. I hope I'm not saying too much. Yeah, but that's what was happening. So I have to I have to do things quickly and then I bring in this compressor and then this compressor give the vocal some strength. Along with this compressor, I added this EQ from Wave to boost the mid range because the vocal mainly sit at the mid range of the frequency of the frequency spectrum. So I bring in this compressor, this EQ rather, I bring in this EQ to boost the mid range of the vocal. So with that, the vocal now start to come alive and it sounded like this. Wait, thinking about the food you put on my plate. I'ma get money in the damn good day. And I get time what the people will say. Only if you take me for Christ or grace. Only if you take me for Christ or grace. Make up my enemy to die the face. I don't wanna fall like yesterday. I oh love. Oh, I don't So at this juncture in the session in saga, I now realized that the vocal was the vocal was coming out with too much siblings, too much S's, too much T's. So I, I use this preset from from Wave. It's called Mil She. And then this this preset gave me the frequency range of 10 kilohertz. So I just adjust the threshold to minus 30 dB and then it helped to squash all those harshness within the vocal. And then next, 
I insert a river, my you, I can insert river, and then I also want to send because I want the vocal to sit inside the beat. I don't want the vocal to be way above the beat that some of our songs we hear around here. Some of our LRB songs around here are not properly mixed. You cannot mix a song and then the vocal is far above the beat. No one is dancing to the vocal. People are dancing to the instrumentation. There are three sounds within the instrumentation that has the rhythm. One, the kick. Two, the rim shot or you snare or clap. And three, the low end. Sometimes the guitar will carry rhythm. So you don't form a sound that has the rhythm within the instrumentation. I need to teach that on a separate video. But now let's come here. So this reverb, what I was doing is that it was bringing a little wetness within the insert to create a little space between the human ear and the sound. So at this junction, this is what I did. I just used a very short decay time. And then I did something that was sounding nice. And then I added this morph click. Now this morph click, you know when an artist is recording the lips movement, or the on the lips and the tone, you will, will be recorded by the microphone. So after you put all this process on the vocal to help to keep the vocal alive, those annoying sounds will also come alive. So you have to well, cut them off. That's why the plugin is for. It's called ROX Move D Click. So you help it to get rid of all those in the inside the vocal. So after I, I feel all this whole place. Before we now sound it is. Wait, think you wanna fool you put on my play. I won't get money in the damn god day. And I get time what the people will say. Only if it takes the price of grace. So from this sound, from this, where the vocal was sounding very faint under the beat from this. So this sound now where the vocal is really alive so the vocal has come alive but not far ahead of the beat the beat the instrumentation is a guardian is a guardian to the vocal it cannot it, the, the vocal cannot swallow the, the, the instrumentation the instrumentation is like a guardian to the vocal so it, it should be within the the, the vocal should be within the instrumentation, but still are uh, clear enough. So these are just the insert now to the synth. I have a short river, I have a long river. So altogether, I have three river on this project. Now this long river, I compress. I do a searching compression so that whenever the the vocal the vocal just stop singing you will hear the effect of the river and then i have this delay i did the same thing to, to the delay I, I do a searching compression to the to the delay so if i pull everything on if i pull everything on now the entire thing sounded like this Wait, think you about the food you put on my plate. I'm gonna get money in the damn good day. And I get time what the people will say. Only if you take me for Christ of grace. Only if you take me for Christ of grace. Make up my enemy to die their face. I don't wanna fall like yesterday. I, oh Lord, oh, I don't wanna fall down. I, cause I'm money though, cause I'm money though. Oh, oh. So this song have a background vocal that sounds like a shaki, a shaki kind of choir vocal. So I will play that the background vocal for you. I will show you how I mix it maybe in another video. So the background vocal sound like this. Destiny, 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 destiny. 
so you hear so you hear uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. that sound is in the background but it sounds like that kind of a shake kind of feel that's that's how i miss it it might not be preferable in it resemble so yeah so basically that's how i come about with this nice sounding song this song as about the time you're watching this video i don't think this song is out now but to, to know if this song is out you have to check on on my page you see the link to this song once this one is out you check on my page you will see the link to this song trap daddy and robert nasty are the two artists on this song it's called destiny it's a very nice song and i think i did well on this project so i'm proud to come out and show the people what i did there are always room for improvement so we were listening keenly again and, and, and try to enjoy some things so before i go let me play a few let me play a few bars let me play the verse two and the bridge for you before i go I'm right guy, I don't pay off, I don't for no one to pass my car. I won't get money in the damn good day. I look in carry, mama sweet cake. Small picky testing, testing day. Or do I fire my enemy? And I think they say that I own story. Own story. Oh no, I take come up in a way. Think you better for you put on my play. I won't get money in the damn good day. And I get time what the people will say. Oh no, I take come up in a way. Think you better for you put on my play. I won't get money in the damn good day. And I get time what the people will say. Only you fit take me for Christ of grace. Only you fit take me for Christ of grace. Make up my enemy to die a face. I don't wanna fall like yesterday. I oh love, oh, I don't wanna fall down. I cause I'm money though, cause I'm money though. Oh, oh. Thank you very much for watching this video. I want to say I am Alvin Yonce Beats. I produce Afrobeat instrumental every time on this page, but today I decided to show you how I went about to mix this song. In subsequent time, I will show you how I did the backing vocal, or maybe another video will come again concerning mixing. So at this point, I would like to say thank you and thanks for watching. Catch you live in the next video. Bye.